If color gradation reproducibility has become so poor that the gradation in the printed or copied images differ markedly from the print data or original documents, gradation adjustment may improve the problem. There are two types of adjustment, full adjustment and quick adjustment. A quick adjust maintains the optimized status that was acquired by a full adjust. If you perform a quick adjust and the results are not satisfactory, perform a full adjust. This video covers the full adjustment procedure. Select Settings Registration, Adjustment Maintenance, Adjust Image Quality, Auto Adjust Gradation. Shown here is the screen on a 3700 series device. Depending on your model, this screen will be different. For example, here is a screen for a 5700 series. Firstly, if you are logged in as a system manager on a compatible device, you will be able to change the adjustment level. If you do have this option, then you will be able to change between simple and by paper type group. Simple allows you to calibrate on a single stock and adjustment will be applied to all papers. By paper type group requires you to calibrate on different stock weights. Not all models offer this choice. Here I will be showing the by paper type group process. If you have the option to use simple, this will be a quicker process to perform. However, by paper type group is more accurate. This particular model offers the ability to scan prints using either the feeder or off the platen glass. I'm going to show both processes. If you have the option to use the feeder, this will be a quicker process to perform. Firstly, load the calibration paper into the multi-purpose tray. The recommended paper is the Mondi range. For standard plain auto gradation, the recommended weight is 100 GSM. The heavy auto gradation depends on the model and the paper weights you are using in your environment. Please ensure when you load the paper you specify the appropriate weight. Here I have loaded 100 GSM. Select the plane adjustment. Select full adjust. Select the tray where the paper is located. The first adjustment page is printed. Note that depending on the model and configuration, the adjustment page may print to a tray that you otherwise would not use. Place the print on the glass and the orientation indicated on screen. Press the Start Scanning button. When the scan is complete, you'll be prompted to print another page. Repeat this process as many times as the model requires. Normally, this would be three to four sheets. This completes the auto gradation process for plain paper. If your model offers the ability to scan using the feeder, then all pages will be printed and you can place them in the feeder to scan. As we are calibrating by paper type group, we need to repeat this process for the different weights. You only need to perform these additional calibrations if you're actually using paper in that weight range. Load the heavy paper into the multi-purpose tray, selecting the correct paper type. Select the heavy option on the auto gradation screen and perform the same steps as previous. Please be aware you may not be able to use the feeder for scanning if you are calibrating on cardstock. Repeat this process for all used papers or features. 
For details specific to your model, please consult the user guide. This completes the auto gradation process and this video.